Hi everyone, I'm Marsha Titus. I am a language services coordinator at the Multicultural Association. I also volunteer at Port City Church where I am a Kid City team lead. And I am Kayore Titus. I am a systems and network administrator at Acton. And I also volunteer at Port City and I'm on the tech team. I'm currently very active in my community. I am associated with United Way. I'm an ambassador for the United Way. We get to volunteer with various agencies just to try to mitigate the unignorable issues in our community. It is great. I am also a part of the Multicultural Association and it's near and dear to my heart being an immigrant myself. Um, for me, uh, it's similar. I do volunteer for the United Way and um, Multicultural Association. It's something that I like. It, it feels very fulfilling, helping others. Well, what drives me, again, it might sound a bit cheesy, but it is my kids, my family. Just seeing those little faces looking on me each day, I know I have to get up. I know I have to get out there and do good because they're always looking on. And for me, what drives me is uh, just seeing the change in the community people getting better, living healthier, and having the opportunity to make life for themselves. I love Fort McMurray, and it sounds a little bit odd, and I know my husband is looking at me because when I came here from Toronto, it was a huge change. But honestly, I don't see myself living anywhere else. It has become home, it is quiet, it gave me an opportunity to be closer to my family, it's a close-knit community, and it's great. For me, being here, um, Fort McMurray is more family-oriented, um, you know, and I love the outdoors, so the trails, hiking, biking, that kind of stuff, I really like it, and my kids have kind of fallen in love with that, and I don't think I could leave it just because they love it so much. I'm so excited to be a part of Top 50. It's an amazing honor. It is something that I always saw and wanted to be a part of, so thank you. I'm happy. Well, for me, it's very exciting as well. Um, since I came to Fort McMurray and saw that Top 50 Under 50 magazine, I've always wanted to be in it, and four years later, here I am. My advice to anyone is never give up. Life throws us some hard punches, but stand up, keep going, keep at it. You never know when your time is near. And for me, my advice is don't move from plus 32 to my, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, being here in Fort McMurray has shown me that you can achieve your dreams. You can really make a change, a big change, moving from a country where it's always warm to where you can be cold and um, just make a difference in the community.